Hi, this is Big Lose. Welcome back to Let's Play Neverwinter Nights 2 Original Campaign. Instead of continuing on with the main plot, we're going to be going towards the Sky Mirror to do Eleni's side quest. And here's a cutscene. This is the place. The Sky Mirror is ahead, but there are challenges we must face. The path to the Sky Mirror is a difficult path for anyone not of the Circle to walk. And it is also sealed against any who might accidentally stray near its waters, both for their protection and those of the Circle. Oh, really? The Sky Mirror is a powerful scrying device, capable of speaking to others who have touched its waters. It takes magic of the land to open the tides of the Sky Mirror. We may need to rest so I can cast the magic required. The challenge changes with every turning of the season, and so do the wards. I won't know the challenges until we come upon them. It's okay, I do. You should know that these paths are meant to only be walked with one of the circle. Those that come here without such a guide? This place... It is still filled with those that have wandered into these sacred woods and could not escape. They live still, but only as reflections of themselves. Try to avoid them, but if we cannot, then be prepared to fight. And the Sky Mirror itself has given rise to guardians as well. Creatures of the water. Good. Very well. Be on your guard. We are still a ways from our destination, and the path is a long one. Okay, so she was talking about undead and some water elementals, and we'll be seeing those a little bit later. Now, this is a little puzzle. You click on these trees, and it tells you... Well, first is this one. It says it has Everyone, follow me. a bull on it. So good thing I have memorized the spells ahead of time. Here's bull strength. Feel no They only call for level 2 druid spells, so you can get them right away. I believe so. And then when you click on the tree it says that the symbol has disappeared. And you got four of these to do. Now, if you're not at a higher level, yes. Eleni might only have three slots, so you might have to rest up. This one says, no A Leaping Panther, so I'm casting Cat's Grace. And the symbol is gone. And yes, I do know what these were ahead of time, so that's why I had them prepared so I didn't have to rest during the video. Okay, so half tree and half flesh face means bark skin. And we got one more left. And to your left is the Sky Mirror itself. It's like a pond or a small lake. And this tree has the symbol of an owl on it, so we're gonna cast Owl's Wisdom. And after you do the last one, you click on it and you get a piece of bark that flakes off, and that's your offering to the Sky Mirror. So let's get rid of these ones that I'm not going to use right now. And we'll put in Flame Weapon and two Lesser Restorations. And then we'll rest up now because I plan on using them in the near future. I believe so. So let's go over here and it will enact a cutscene. This is the Sky Mirror. Do not stray too close to its waters. They can be a shock to the uninitiated. Give me a moment to center myself, and then I can try to contact the druids of Neverwinter Wood. All it requires is placing this offering within the Sky Mirror's waters, and then we shall wait. Eleni? Child, is that you? Elder Navin? Can you hear me? Yes, child. Where are you? I am touching the waters of the Sky Mirror, but I had thought to contact the druids of Neverwinter Wood 
not one of my own circle. I was traveling for the past season, not as long from the mayor as you, perhaps. And only recently have I returned from the Sword Coast. Whoa. This is Elder Naven, one of my circle. He has been a part of it for almost as long as Vashni and the others, but I did not realize he had left the mayor. He cannot hear you, but I can communicate your questions to him if you wish. Elder Naven, why were you traveling? And where are the druids of Neverwinter Wood? My path has been a long one. What I have found, and what I have not, troubles me. Like you, I have had no success in contacting the druids of Neverwinter Wood. I suspect they are avoiding me, or have cut themselves off from others. We encountered one in Neverwinter, and he had come in search of one of the Circle of the Mayor, either you or I, but had found no one, not even Elder Vashni. That is troubling news, and part of what drove me here. I returned, because I felt something was wrong with the Mayor, and I have not been able to reach any of the other druids. This failing from the Mayor, it is like a black silence stretching through Mare Delane and even seeing through the eyes of animals and birds has proved useless. Elder Naven, we did find one of the Circle of the Mare. Khalil, he was maddened and we were forced to fight him. What? How did this happen? Elder, I do not know. I fear it is tied to whatever is occurring in the Mare. And he said that our Circle, that it was lost. If so, we may be the only two left. We shall see with our own eyes first. This news of Khalil saddens me. Was there no other way? Elder, Khalil was driven mad. He had slaughtered the animals of Maiden's Glade, tore them apart while he was trapped in the form of a bear. Troubling. It must not have been an easy thing to do. Such an act of mercy, Eleni. Elder Naven, we came here to ask the lore keepers of Neverwinter Wood if they knew anything of what was happening at the mare. And we fear that whatever is occurring in the mare is tied to a set of silver fragments we carry. Silver fragments? Like the one carried by that village boy you were watching? Hey! Uh, yes, but he did not carry it. It was hidden near the village, I believe. He retrieved it from the Ilfarn ruins there. Hmm, that is a strange coincidence. But perhaps not. The darkness clouding the mare. It is familiar in some respects to events that occurred at the time of the discovery of those shards. During the war against the King of Shadows long ago, a similar darkness infested the mare, though not as thick as it is now. Can he have returned? There were many battles fought on the mare, and at its borders, one even at West Harbor. Eleni, I must continue on to the mare and try to find what became of Vashni and the others. Even if they are dead, I must see it with my own eyes and see what I can do to find out more about this threat and the shards you speak of. Of course, Elder Naven. Good fortune, Eleni. I know of your vigil, but now we must focus our sight back to where it belongs, on the lands we tend. I... I know, Elder Naven. Forgive me. I will contact you when I know more. I will send a messenger. You will know it when it arrives. Until we meet again, Eleni, beware the shadows. All right, then. There is nothing more we can do here, I'm afraid. What was that? Something is wrong. The spirits are gathering. We must leave at once. We are not welcome here. Okay, so we got 400 What's going EXP on? for that. No, I sense danger. So, Cora, you cast mage armor and shield on yourself. Everyone, follow me! Dear John. Eleni, you cast stone skin on Captain Savajo. And why don't you cast bark skin on yourself? Yes, I believe flame weapon would do very nicely here. Well, now, what do you want? I did mention undead previously. All right, let's go around the left side of the path. Okay. Now we got some ghasts. Let us press and the attack. Water elemental. Uh, too close for fireball. 
Not close enough for call lightning. Attack! Let's see. Yeah, missile storm. Let's just let him have it. Alright, looks like Eleni got some ability damage, so yes. let's have her cast Lesser Restoration on her stuff without having to resort to resting. Well now, what do you want? I am listening. It'll save a little bit of time, but five seconds is five seconds. Let us press the attack! Well, no. What do you want? All those five seconds add up. Okay, we got some this more. Ah! Uh, okay, now I'm gonna need lesser restoration on Captain Sabaho. Go this way. And we got some guys up here. Let's see what they have to say. Druidus, we have come for you. You have felt us in the land. Now, feel the touch of darkness upon you. Alright, so I'm going to use the stinking cloud wand on these guys to try to stun them. So, maybe about mm, right there ought to do it. My key is right, Botic. Kelgar, don't go in right away because I don't want you dazed. There we go. All right, now let's get these guys who ran out. I could do that. That's what you get for attacking for us. Oh, that missed Kelgar. Pretty good. Alright, all that's left is this guy right here. Get him. This is what summoned the protectors of the Sky Mirror here. This priest. But the way is hidden. How did he manage to find his way here? We must leave. If we remain, others may come. Alright, so let's see what's in his treasure bag. I am listening. Plus two scimitar, light shield plus one, a gem, and cure critical wounds. Alright, Eleni, I think you can have all of them. Now, the light shield plus one is superior by one point of armor class over the shield of dawn, but the shield of dawn gives you plus two versus undead, so against undead it's better. I believe so. And we will fight a lot of undead. So let's go back to the city of Neverwinter. And endure another cutscene. Come out of the shadows. I have no patience for your hostile tricks. Surely you understand my caution. The Hostower has heard of your loss and the involvement of the little flame-haired sorceress we have heard so much about. Our condolences. We even heard a rumor that she is fighting the rest of your students on the streets of Neverwinter. 
A terrible state of affairs. The actions of those children are no concern of mine. They have been punished. But this girl, Quara, she killed my daughter in cold blood in the Neverwinter Docks in some filthy tavern brawl. And that I will not abide. But these crimes this girl Quara has committed, surely you have told the Nine what has transpired. The Nine have their hands full with politics and troubles at the docks. They will not help, and especially with my house out of favor with Nasher. This is something I wish to handle myself. Yourself? And yet you have contacted the Huss Tower about this matter. It is strange you would summon us. We are not welcome in Neverwinter, and never in the Academy grounds. If you aid me, I will aid you. Neverwinter need not be closed to you and your school. I could promise you students, disciples, even slaves. And what is it you wish done? I wish to hear Quara scream. To feel the same pain my daughter did when she was struck down. I want Quara to suffer. To turn a sorcerer's power against them. <laughs> it is an old technique, as old as Ilfarn itself. But I think you will find we are not strangers to this art. Ooh, sinister. I wonder what that forebodes couldn't be anything good for Quora. Well, I'm going to end the episode, so this is Big Los signing off. Hope you enjoyed the episode. I'll see you next time, and as always, have a good day. <laughs>